Welcome to the shortwave channel and uh, I just wanted to do a little demonstration of how different antennas are actually um, giving different performance on some frequency ranges. I uh, tuned to the 49 meter band with my Yesu, which I honestly never do because um, as I've explained in some of the live shows, uh, the noise floor below 8 nine eight megahertz is so high that i just don't go there um, with the nfed antenna in the backyard yet i go there with my mla30 because it actually performs so much better on that range and an example here is i got wwcr on 5935 which packs a good signal here in montreal at night and it's so noisy mostly noise and uh, if you look at what I have to put as a level for the waterfall to look decent it's like I really got to put the I don't even have the amplifier on so this here IPO is straight amplification from the radio nothing extra because I got two amps that I can kick in here and look at how many decibels how many dBs I gotta lower the sensitivity uh, in order for the radio to actually have a decent waterfall that's usable. So, uh, and you see, it's very noisy. Now, same signal, same signal, and the same signal is on this little Gundic portable, okay? 5935. Yeah. And you can hear that it's crystal clear and it's on the MLE 30. So I've plugged the MLE 30 on this radio. So it tells you and shows you the huge difference between types of antennas, frequency range you're listening to. So in this case, um, you know, I, I'm not going to DX on these frequencies with the Yesu unless I put the MLE 30 on it. Um, so that's, that's, Definite, but you know on higher frequencies is the other way around. So um, I don't know if I can at this time We can still hear it if I go on 15 megahertz I'm not hearing it, but um, Any signals I can tune here I'm not happening up there It's winter I don't know if So let's try this signal, 12050, which is kind of a transition zone. So 1, 2, 0, 5, 0. So here's the difference. I uh, hope you can hear it. It's it's not that bad on the Yesu. But yet on the... On the MLE 30, it's noisier and not as strong. So you see that there is a huge difference. It's still noisy, but less noisy on the Yesu. And as I go up in frequency, it's going to be even the separation is going to be even bigger. Uh, here it's still workable, but if I go like, you know, when I listen to the BBC on 11 meters, uh, BBC World Service on 25900, on the MLE 30, uh, I barely hear it with a portable and even whatever radio I use, but it's often crystal clear on the Yesu with the NFED. So typically what I notice is there's a, um, the, the, the antennas, the way they perform is that um, my NFED with the Yesu, I'd say, you know, 10 megahertz and above, no problem. I, I'm going to use it. It's going to work great. And uh, that's why also I prefer doing amateur radio on the 30 meters and up bands because that's where it's working the best. 
Um, I do a little bit of 40 meters, but 40 meters is very noisy. Uh, and the several times that I called CQ on 40 meters, actually with the Yesu, um, I seem to have the problem that I, I discussed once uh, or twice. It's uh, people hear me because my signal is going out, but I don't hear the people calling back because my noise floor is too high on 40. So, you know, that's that's the, the biggest problem. But, um, you know, if I want to go below 10 megahertz, I have an option. I use the MLA 30 on my radios. And that gives me, you know, great reception, great receive of, of signals uh, for sure. So it's going to, you know, it's 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 life. Uh, but at least I have an option. And that that's the, the, the really the great thing here is having an option to tune when something is happening. Let me try something here. If I can hear uh, very low. Anyways, I can try it with another signal also. Actually, I'm not going to go to SSB. Uh, if I punch in... So CHU. That's on the MLE 30. And if I punch in CHU here... Good luck. There you go. Nothing. It's barely, barely audible. Yet on, on, <coughs> sorry. So, you know, I got an option. At least that's cool. Uh, because if it would be only the NFED antenna, I would be a little sad and, and I'd lose the lower frequencies. But at least I can DX the lower frequencies. Uh, listening uh, using you know my MLE 30 magnetic loop shows you the the difference here uh, in the antennas if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up and thank you for watching